Hi. Hello and welcome back to the Lucky Isle. Why am I dressed like that? No reason. No reason at all. Uh, I finally caught my first two scorpions. Uh, this is the first one I caught. And the alley is in the museum, so that's good. Also, I got a friend from my turtle, but I'm not sure what her name is. Maybe we should call it. Uh, I'm not sure how to say that in English. Bodil? Bodil doesn't sound great. Oh well. We still have our mannequin things, but this morning. Uh. The next rock did spawn the right place. I think it's this one. Yeah, I think it's this one. And I broke this one, so now I'm just waiting for these two to respawn tomorrow and uh, the day after tomorrow. And that's Monday, yes. Monday, hopefully, we'll be all done with this bullshit and we can finally remove our mannequins. So I changed something. We don't have the secret path here anymore. And now you're confusion because... How do you get to Red's place then? Hehehe. <laughs> oh, I'll show you. If I can get past all the mannequins. All the way over here. We have a little secret. <gasps> a secret? Yes. Ta da! It goes right to the secret beach. And if you follow this sign that says, <gasps> there's some secret market over here? You can go over here and you come to this very secret market. It's so secret that I can't even see where I'm going. Um, I'm not really sure about this because, well, obviously you can't really see much, but uh, it's it's kind of cute. It's a little bit cute. This just, well, you can't really see what you're doing out here, so I'm not sure what I'm doing about that. I just thought it was funny. Uh, we are demolishing this staircase right here because I think it's it's a it's a waste. That's why I put it on the first layer, the um, the secret path here. So I don't need this uh, staircase. I can use it for something else, which will probably be up here to get to the third layer. I'm gonna build that out right now, actually. But first, I want to move my farm like a little closer to my. Um, my backyard here, so it's like one space and then my farm here. Of course, I have to terraform a little bit to do that. <laughs> These mannequins are really in the way. Also, another thing that happened today. Uh, I got another yellow mom yesterday. Friday. And uh, those two happened to produce this thing. The green mom. And I really, I'm really happy about that because they, they really they will match my uh, pear trees very well. But the weird thing is, they have like a 4% or 7% chance to make it, I think it's 7%, 7% chance to make a green mom. And the first thing they do, they make a green mom. So uh, now I'm just waiting for these to make a purple and I can remove this. Also I need to breed pansies soon, I don't have any pansies up, I don't know why. And windflowers. But uh, not until we're done with, uh, with these guys here. I just need a purple and then I'm done with uh, c uh, Cosmos? No. Mums. Mums. <laughs> and is it, what am I trying to get here? Is it a blue I'm trying to get? I'm also still awaiting anything with my lilies. Anything with black that is. That's why there's no red next to each other anymore. So I'm trying to get orange and I'm trying to get pink. And it's just no luck. No luck with them. Trying to get uh, black here for Kevin's house. And uh, orange, orange, and of course the blue. Um, I want to show you a cute little area before we start working today. I put up some country fences because I really want to spruce my place up with more fences, and the country fence is just so cute for the more, so the more rural area, I guess. Even if I do like uh, putting the leg stakes up, these are a little bit cheaper to make for me. I make this little cute uh, star gazing area. Wait sleep out here and then you can look at stars and uh, there's some little candle lights which is so cute I really like this I like putting up small little detail things like this it's gonna be real nice um, once I clean out these mannequins of course because I'm gonna put some garden lanterns up and maybe some more of these little lights and it's gonna be real cute I wonder if I can put up a little stone from light here, but that would that would be behind the tree, so it would be kind of 
Silly to do that. Maybe we should put the flower here instead and put a little cute thing here. I'm not sure. I like the Florida though. Sorry, I'm just thinking about how I can optimize the space. Because here, there wasn't really anything here before. Oh, yeah, there was a cliff. I tried to create a cliff and put the things up here, but I like more than I can... Uh, when there's more space here, right? So I can decorate more. Norma gave me the recipe for this tree. That's not a tree. That's a table. <laughs> Yesterday, and it was... It was a magical moment because I love this table. It's perfect for, like, cafe or... Just a little cute place. I don't have the chair spot yet, but I think that if you take the garden chairs and paint them black, they'll go pretty okay well with this uh, table anyways. So it wouldn't be a problem. Um, I'm just thinking about what kind of things I want to use for the cafe area, so it's a bit of a mess here. Ozzy, if you don't mind, I'm gonna test something real quick with you. I did learn a new drill trick here. If you... Ozzy, why did you have to leave when I'm about to show this? You can uh, get some pretty nice camera angles if you start the camera app and then take a picture immediately. Because the UI will be gone. And it's really nice. I hope to god that Nintendo won't take this away from me. It means a lot to me. Ozzy, why do you have to leave the shot? I can't move my camera anymore. I wouldn't have known this if I didn't see Cleric's video, so thank you very much for that. Thank you for sharing those glitches, those, th those are just great. But that one is definitely my favorite. <laughs> okay, so... Mm, yeah, let's clean up this mess here. I'll have to kill some... spruce trees. Do I have to kill them? Yeah, I probably have to kill them. Well... <sighs> it was fun knowing you, spruce trees. I have plenty in my inventory. I don't really need any more, so... Let's just rip. Oh, whoopsies. Can I even break this cliff when there's a mannequin up there? Should be able to. Oh, okay. It's fine. And this is why we have our turnips. But then I can have the rogue go out here, so I probably need to move this tree. Not probably, I will have to move this tree. Ta-da! How oh, nice. I really like how that looks because it's kind of overlapping with the green and it's like... Oh, it's perfect. I wish weeds didn't grow when it rained. Because it's, it's it's really annoying when you want to try and use them for something. Like if you like clovers. They won't stay clovers, sadly. I haven't gotten a new money tree and I don't know how long because these mannequins are apparently stopping the gold spots from spawning. I don't know why. I haven't seen a gold spot in so many days. Because now we have a lot more space to work with. What are we going to do with all this new space? You may ask. Oh, no. I don't have any ideas, but you know, this, this is the best part of Animal Crossing, just tearing something down and realizing, wow, I have so much new space. One thing I actually don't like about my town is my villagers' houses. They don't have a big backyard where I can just put items up. It would be cool if I could, like, get, like, those gas station items and put it around Rash's house because, you know, he has that theme in his house and I could like theme all the houses like Norma would have a little farm because she's like she's a cow. But the the way I have laid them out doesn't really allow me to make those kind of backyards. Norma I'm gonna utilize this because I'm not sure if it gets patched. Please, Nintendo, please don't patch this. This is this is my favorite thing in this game ever. Oh, you're leaving, Norma. Don't leave this shot, Norma, please. I want the cliff to go all the way out here. And we'll make an incline so we can get up. Luckily, since we don't have any more money trees, we can just get rid of these. If I could hit them. I just have to make sure that this is the amount of space I need for a new farm on the second layer. I haven't gotten a new uh, golden rose yet, but it's fine. It's only been a few days and I got one, I'm not getting greedy. Golden roses can't duplicate, by the way. Um, they can only be bred. Oh, but is it breeding? It's not really breeding, it's just the black ones that have produced them because they have been watered with a golden ham. So it's not breeding. Um, 
But yeah, they can't duplicate. There we go. I still need bushes here, that's why those trees markings are there. It's not that I want a tree there, it's just I want some kind of greenery, that's what that means. Oh, you didn't disappear, I'm glad. Will you give me an item? You should put a silo here or something. I can actually make the silo. I believe. Oh, I can! It's just a little expensive. Yeah, let's make it, why not? Yay! A side could be customized, that's actually why I got interested in it. Because I think it's not the most pretty thing in the world. But you know, when there is a farm, you should- ooh. That's kinda meh. That's kinda- ooh, ooh, wow, ah, wow. This one's- this one's just pastel, and I'm not really going for that. I'm thinking this one, or the rustic one. <sighs> I really like this. But I don't think it fits in with the environment. It will fit with my house, maybe. Don't really know about this. It's a bit big. It's like a little cave. It would be cool if you could like build a layer above here and just keep it there without, you know. It wouldn't make sense though because it was no would be nothing to support it, but you can make a little cave. Of course you can see in here, so it would be kinda <laughs> It would just be cool to make a cave an animal crossing. Who wouldn't do that? I probably would. I don't know what you put in the cave though. Maybe a bear or something. Maybe the raccoon statue. That would that would surely scare people off. I'm a little extra with these mannequins. Just a little bit. I reckon that should be enough mannequins. This leg staircase is gonna go. And I'm gonna make a new one. Where you can see it better. Where it will be make more sense, because you know. Why would Tom Nook agree to build a staircase down here to this beach where Red comes dealing? He knows this is a sketchy place. Just look, there's a freaking skull here. No one just keeps sitting new place. No matter, you know there's a bench, some benches over here you can sit on in case you're you're uncomfortable on the ground. Right over there, like literally, you only have to like take five steps. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna- oh. I just realized that you can get some really cool camo shots in here- Excuse me, Rasher, I'm trying to explain something. Even in the house, because you can- The camera is more freeform. That's a bucket front. Could you please do something funny so we can, you know, make a movie or something? Okay, he's not really photogenic. But that, we always knew that. Oh shit, I didn't talk to him at all. He <laughs> got confused. <laughs> oh no. Sorry, bud. <gasps> Artie! I gave her this stall that I customized to match her dress. And I think it's really neat. If she wouldn't walk around so much. Hi, Artie. Hi. Would you have to eat up in my face? Taking the menu of your own restaurant? Oh, it's so interesting. I wonder what they sell here. Donuts. <laughs> I should want to put uh, my scorpion up here. With my tarantula. Actually. Oh shit, there's a freaking tree there. You know what? I don't want to do this right now. I'm lazy. Some other time, maybe. <laughs> But it would be nice because then we have the scorpion on the one side and it has its own model on it. And the tarantula on this side and it has its own model on it. But I still need uh, three more scorpions to make a scorpion sculpture. What should I call my scorpion? How about Sophus? Sophus is scorpion. If you don't mind, Sophus, I'm gonna push you out of the shot. Because I wanna I wanna get a nice goodbye shot, so uh, 
Sorry, so this. Uh, can you call, like, make a mating call or something for your uh, scorpion friends? Because I would really like another scorpion. Or three more, actually. So I can make you a nice sculpture. Don't worry, they'll be safe at Flick's place. He, he, he uses to let them crawl over over him and stuff. And you'll just be in his terrarium. No, I'm, I, 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 hey, I'm giving them such a nice view. Look at that. Charlie has the best view in the world. Look, they're thriving. Don't you want to thrive too? Then call all your scorpion friends! Please! Anyways, that was a little progress update, and we did some terraforming too, so... I hope you enjoyed it, and... I really like this cinematic camera thing we have here. Please, Nintendo, let us keep this. Please! Thanks for watching, and I hope I'll see you next time!